Hey guys, I'm Nilesh from iDeserve. Today let's look at the problem of topological sort. So what is topological sort? Topological sorting for a directed acyclic graph is a linear ordering of vertices such that for every directed edge uv, vertex u should appear before vertex v in the ordering. For example, for this particular directed graph in the topological sorted order, vertex 3 will appear before vertex 4 because there is an edge from 3 to 4. Similarly, vertex 3 will also appear before vertex 1 and vertex 1 should appear before vertex 4, 2 and 6. Right? Note that topological sorting for a graph is not possible if the graph is not a directed acyclic graph. For this particular graph, topologically sorted order of all vertices would be this order. Here, Vertex 3 appears before vertex 1 and 4, vertex 1 and 4, vertex 1 appears before 4, 2 and 6, vertex 1 is appearing before 4, 2 and 6, vertex 4 is appearing before vertex 5 and vertex 2, vertex 4 appears before 2 and 5 and so on. Now let's look at the approach to find out the topological sorted order. The first step is, we start with the vertex V having in degree of 0. Here for this particular graph, Vertex 3 has in degree of 0, Vertex 4 has in degree of 2, Vertex 1 has in degree of 1 and so on. So we will start with Vertex 3 because it has in degree of 0. In the second step, we print the Vertex V and remove the Vertex V and all edges coming out of it. We will repeat these two steps till all the vertices are removed. Let's simulate these steps for this particular graph. First step is, we start with vertex V having in degree of 0, that would be vertex 3 because it has in degree of 0. Second step is, we print that vertex V and remove the vertex V and all edges coming out of it. So after execution of second step, our graph will look like this and we also have to print vertex 3. Then we have to repeat these two steps till all vertices from this graph are removed. So we jump to step number 1. We again find the vertex V which has in degree of 0. Here in this reduced graph, if you note, vertex 1 has now in degree of 0. In the second step, we need to print this vertex V and remove these three edges from the graph. So after execution of second step, topological sorted order will look like this and reduced graph will look like this. Because all the vertices from this graph are still not removed, we again jump to step number 1. Now there are two vertices which have in degree of 0, vertex 4 and vertex 6. Now in the second step, we can choose either of these two vertices and proceed. Let's say we choose to remove vertex 4 from the graph, then the sorted order will look like this and reduced graph will be this. We again jump to step number 1. Now note that vertex 2 also has got in degree of 0. In the second step, if we choose to remove vertex 2, modified graph will be this and sorted order will be this. We jump to step number 1 again. Now we know that vertex 6 has got in degree of 0. In the second step, we add this vertex 6 in the sorted order and remove vertex and edge from the graph. Therefore, sorted order will be modified to this and graph will be reduced to this. Now it's pretty obvious that vertex 5 has got in degree of 0. So in the second step, we print this vertex 5 and remove vertex 5 from the graph. Therefore, sorted order will be modified to this. At this point, all the vertices from the graph are removed. Therefore, topological sorting for this example is complete. Finally, for this particular example, our topological sorted order of vertices is this. Now let's look at the Java code which implements this algorithm. To implement the first step of finding a vertex V having in degree of 0, we first have to compute in degrees of all these vertices and then choose vertex with in degree of 0. In this print sorted subroutine, this for loop counts the in degrees for all the nodes. It also adds nodes having in degree of greater than 0 to in degree hash table. After completion of this for loop, our in degree hash table will look like this. Note that vertex 3 is not present in this in degree table because we have added only those vertices which have in degree of greater than 0. Therefore, to find out the vertices which have got in degree of 0, we have to find out the vertices which are not present in this in degree table. This particular for loop 
populates the zero degree list with those vertices which have got in degree of zero. So after completion of this for loop, our zero degree list, zero degree list, will have vertex three into it. So using these two for loops, we have basically implemented this first step of finding out a vertex with in degree of zero. Now let's look into the next part of this code which implements the complete algorithm. Once this zero degree list is populated in this for loop, in the while loop what we do is, we remove the first vertex from this zero degree list, then we print that vertex here which would be in the topologically sorted order. And finally to implement the removal of all outages from current vertex, what we do is, in this while loop, we decrement the in degrees of all the neighbors of current vertex. For example, if the current vertex would have been 3, then we will decrease the in degrees of 4 and 1. That is, 4's in degree would be modified to 1 and 1's in degree would be modified to 0. And for all those vertices which had previous in degree of 1, the modified in degree would be 0 and therefore we will add these vertices into the 0 degree list. So initially in the first iteration of this while loop, our 0 degree list will have only vertex 3 in it. Then at this step, we will print the vertex 3 and in this while loop, what we will do is, for all the neighbors of 3, that is 4 and 1, we will decrement the in degree by 1. So 4's in degree would be modified to 1 and 1's in degree would be modified to 0. And because 1's in degree is now 0, it will be added to the 0 degree list. So after the completion of first iteration of this while loop, our 0 degree list will have vertex 1 in it. Now in the second iteration of this while loop, 1 will be removed from the 0 degree list. It will be printed here and for all the neighbors of 1, that is 4, 2 and 6, in degrees will be decremented by 1. So 4's in degree will be modified to 0, 2's in degree will be modified to 1 and in degree of 6 will be modified to 0. And because the in degree of 4 and 6 is now 0, vertices 4 and 6 are added to the 0 degree list vertex 4 and 6 are added to the 0 degree list. Repeating these steps until our 0 degree list is empty gives us the topologically sorted order of the vertices. The topologically sorted order of vertices would be 3, 1, 4, 2, 6, 5. I hope the explanation was clear. In case you have any queries or feedback, please feel free to comment and do not forget to subscribe. Thank you and cheers.